wouldn't be any of that stuff to us, that we wouldn't pass that on to our kids, that we wouldn't pass that on to our grandkids, that we would be those who love purely and that they could experience that love and it doesn't waver in their heart. Man, that I would be the kind of father that loves my daughters in a way that the man that they married has to have a high standard because I love them correctly and that I protect them correctly and that they, I love them in a way that they don't have to fear and I love and I protect them and that's what they look for in a man because a man is someone who will love and not hurt. A man is one that's not going to cower her down but will value her and lift her up and that I don't have to go and take care of in the desert with a shovel. I mean, this is on video. We didn't say that. No one said that. You see how I started tearing up, so I went into man mode. You see that? But the same for my son, that I would be the kind of man who loves my wife and my daughters and him in a way that's an example to him, that he would see it and he would emulate that because he sees this guy loves God and he wants to love his family and he does so because he has our best interests in mind, even when it's not what I want, but it's better for me in the future that he gets to be that kind of man. Because here's the thing, I don't want my son to be the kind of man I am. I want him to be better than me. I want him to be the stair step that's beyond me. That's what we always told our students, man. Some of them today are in this room whenever I was a youth pastor. I said, listen, I don't want you to be like me. I want you to be way past where I am with God. I want to slingshot you past my experience so that you don't have to hit my potholes. That you get to navigate all that mess and junk and you get to go straight on with your journey with God. And that at a younger age, you experience more of the power and the presence of God in your life than I have yet at this time. That's my hope. That's my prayer for you and for me. That we would be those that love in that kind of way.